today is such a nice day that I'm able to film again outside. Wonderful temperature. But it's winter time and it's cold and this Tuesday so many people celebrate sin. They celebrate their sin thinking, oh, Wednesday, I have to suffer and give up and follow Jesus. Their hearts are cold. Recently, one member, Bob Bowling, passed away. And he now is celebrating life with Jesus. I think my plan is to celebrate with Bob there. Thinking about communion, the Lord's Supper, every year we read one of the three Bible lessons where we see Jesus transfigured. What is that? Really, it happens that we see Jesus exalted. His holiness shines so bright that the disciples had to hide their eyes. They couldn't look at him. Every year we celebrate this event and on the next Tuesday is Fat Tuesday. People satisfy their sinful lust and desire before Lent begins. Perhaps that gives us one reason that God the Father led Jesus to show himself as his Son. In fact, the Father's voice said, You are my Son, my true loved one. Listen to Him. Mark chapter 9, verse 7. Like you can see, People still refuse to listen to Jesus. Sin so excites us that we plan fat Tuesday, a Fat Tuesday event before we give up sin and serve God. That truly shows that people misunderstand faith's meaning. Suppose you were Peter, standing there, hiding your eyes from Jesus' brightness, hearing God the Father say, listen to him, wanting to stay on the mountain and continue that life. Think of that. Then you come down from the mountain and plan this Tuesday to do every sinful desire that you can plan to do. That attitude continues to misunderstand the new life that God gives on the day that he baptized you. Romans chapter 6 verses 1 through 6. 
and like a cloth covering the Jewish people's stubborn minds, their plan shows that Jesus does not live in them. 2 Corinthians chapter 3, verses 12 through 16. Jesus died on the cross, and God the Father's glory rose Jesus to life again. His life in us is not sometimes life, but it is from now on, through death, to life eternal. Notice, from now on includes this Tuesday. My son, listen to him. Will you attend Jesus' words? Take, eat, take, drink. This is my body and blood. You attend that when Jesus welcomes you to the Lord's Supper. He forgives you so you can live his new life. Today, every day, and this Tuesday. We pray. O oh God, on the mountain, Jesus showed his glory. Truly, he is your only son, true God and true man. Help us believe your truth, your word. Help our faith continue strong. Finally, one day before your throne in heaven, we will share Jesus' glory there. We pray, trusting Jesus' holy name. Amen.